Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole and I make Dungeons and Dragons miniatures and other fantasy stuff. And then sometimes just whatever I feel like making. <laughs> oh my god. <coughs> oh. Sorry, I think I'm getting sick. Stop. I know what you're thinking. Wow, Nicole, you look like a boy. Oh, what happened to your hair? You look like Moses in Prince of Egypt when uh, he's buried in the sand and the camel thinks his hair is grass, so he like bites his head and pulls him out of the sand. That's a really obscure reference, but if you know it, let me know in the comments, because that's a really good movie. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know, I decided to cut it, because I was bored, and also it's summertime, and I've never had it, like, shorter than my shoulders. Anyways, I have plans also, d, &D shirt, hell yeah. When life gives you a shirt that's too big, turn it into a crop top. Also, I have a new tattoo. I got these rings. I also, I never actually showed you guys, but I got a D20 on my hand. It's really cool because now when I'm at work and I'm like handing people their change back, they're like, oh my god, you play D&D? And I'm like, represent. <laughs> my friend's birthday's coming up, so I'm making her something. She used to play a flying kobold named Moe's, who was technically evil and just ate garbage and was like, adorable as fuck. So now she's playing Moe's twin, who's like the good twin, and her name is Megus. And I just really want to make her a flying kobold mini because, I don't know, they, they thought they had one, turns out they didn't, and I was like, well, I know the solution to this. <laughs> oh god, I don't think I've ever made wings. Why is it every time I do a video, I'm literally doing the, like something for the first time ever? I guess that's how you learn how to make things. Oh boy, it's gonna be so... it's gonna be so fun. <laughs> So this is kind of like the, um, this is a bit of the head, this could be like the chest. When you do the shoulders, you sort of wrap it around here. This is like the torso, um, and then for the hips, you just kind of put it out like this. You know, you, sp you splay it out. Now kobolds, I would say, have like sort of a wide-ish stance. Let's just take this, we're just gonna bend it down. All right, so cobalt legs, they kind of go like forward into a knee, but then they also have that like weird ankle bit. So it's like, it's like ch -ch -ch. So hopefully I have enough um, wire here to do that. So let's bring them forward. <clears throat> and then let's do this, bring it back. Yeah, and then we do this. Right forward again, like a foot. So it's sort of, sort of like this. Um, I should have left myself more slack to like stick it into the uh, thing, but I'm sure that we'll make it work. So kind of like, sort of like this. Uh, let's see, it's been this a little bit more. Bend it, like Beckham. This is too tall. I made it like normal people sized. Shouldn't be. I'm gonna try again. That's too big. hungry it hurts oh look my board game shelf I'm starving my kitchen is kind of a disaster uh, so is my hair I am so tempted to have angel food cake for dinner <laughs> me man why am I so fat and chubby also me has angel food cake for dinner Devin's ready yesterday I had mall teasers for dinner because I am an adult <laughs> Anyway, I'm just baking on like the little bit in the middle to keep all the wire together and then Ow, and then we'll go downstairs and uh, put his skin on My little things are growing
actually so sick. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. So I started making this mini like five days ago, but this is day five of being incredibly sick. I'm still gonna finish it today because uh, I have to give it to Becky today. There's no holding back. <laughs> So it's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. So I just have a bit of an announcement as regard to my Patreon. I really appreciate everybody who's been my patron for the last year. You guys have like honestly, you've inspired me and you've made me feel way more confident in my like artistic abilities and I'm so happy that I did it and I love you guys. As you guys probably know by now, I I've mentioned it in one or two videos, but I am actually going back to school in the fall. So I'll be starting a two year program in September. And it's full time, and I'm also gonna be working, which means I am gonna have to step away from Patreon at least for a little while. I really wanna come back to it, and I'm so happy that I did it. So, even though I am stepping away from Patreon, at least just for a little bit, I hope that you stick around. You know, check out my Instagram, my Twitter, I have a website. I hope anyone who is thinking of being a patron still wants to stick around. And I really appreciate the support that I've gotten for, you know, deciding to go back to school even as a mature student. and. You know, I will still make videos. You know, maybe I'll even make more like vloggy kind of things. Who knows? I just really need to make sure that I am putting school first so that I can, you know, finish that two years and get that out of the way and, you know, do adult responsibility life things. You know, I, I hope that anyone who was on my Patreon enjoyed being there with me. I loved having you and I look forward to doing it again down the road. I, I know that I just need to tackle this, you know, school thing for a bit. But I still look forward to making more videos and talking to you guys and hanging out. So I'm still going to do that. I'm not going anywhere. I just need to make sure that I am focused. So yeah, thank you so much for hanging around. Thank you so much for joining my Patreon if you were on it. And if you were thinking about it, I really appreciate it. You know, keep in touch. I'm still going to be here. And I love you so much. Goodbye. Okay,